Hey, what's up, y'all? It's Crack Lagging and Z. About to react to this video about comedy space. This is Jason Momoa constantly being flirted with. I don't know if that's how you say his last name or not. Um, but I understand why. He was on Game of Thrones, and I just remember what's his name like. I don't know. I want to say Kyle Drago. Is that right? I feel like that's right. That sound right. Is that somebody from Harry Potter? Kyle Drago. I think Kyle Drago was his name, but I don't know why I'm thinking of. Harry Potter, oh, Drago Malfoy, okay, <laughs> different movie. Anyway, so yeah, he was fine. He was fine on there with his long hair, like, you know, so I get it, I get it, but you know, let's see how people flirt with him, let's watch. Welcome to Comedy Space. Please like and subscribe if you enjoy the video. Jason Momoa, the man, the myth, the legend, who is envied by He's hundreds married, of thousands, uh, to if not Lisa millions Bonnet. of men all around the world to be. for his know. seemingly godlike physique his personality, and just overall sexiness and charm that has won over the hearts of women, and men of course, all oh, over the world. As you too? can imagine, although Jason is happily married and has a child, he still gets a lot of female attention. And a lot of the time, it's caught on camera. So today, we're going to be taking a look at some of the times Jason Momoa has been flirted with. So, the first clip we have is what seems to be at some kind of event Q&A where a woman in the audience gets pretty excited and flirtatious when handed the microphone. Take a look. There's some funny questions out there. All right, we're going to put some funny over here. Mahalo. <laughs> Tell them love, I'm used to full of an axe. Be good looking, he's so hot. <laughs> <laughs> you are amazing. Oh, but how are you? So good. So good. I might want to call letter talk. Feeling. Are you Sheesh. smelling him? That was enough to make even Jason blush. Okay, so Cute the next bow clip bow. we have is during an interview with Amber Heard whilst promoting Aquaman. During this interview, oh, he was Aquaman. I didn't see that. As she subtly flirts with Jason with her body language. Also, the interviewer makes a few cheeky comments about Jason as well. Take a look. I think some of the outfits you wear are fantastic. <laughs> Girl, uh, you are. Thank you. Yeah. A, little, a little bit that I There's wear. There's some more than what the should. I feel like that's what she was saying. Uh, <laughs> the Arthur and American film super fast, but which of you is the best? <laughs> she's an amazing actress because she can't swim. She can swim. She can swim. Barely. No, I can swim. Throwing him under the bus. Actually, actually, it's all my stuff in the world. Actually, but you know, it, I was so happy to be. It was one movie where he had to wear far less clothing than I did and had to watch his body. I was just like, that's coasting. A member of the Ocean Girl, he may have realized. Who do you think will be good in the royal family? Oh, it's oh. not the <laughs> royal family. Atlantica. Is that the word? <laughs> yeah. They're all perfect. Did you just think, honestly, did you just pick the only person you were like, what? No. what? You know? Do you see what I mean about Amber's body language? Well, if you don't, you're obviously not a body language expert like myself. Never. The next clip we have is Jason on The Graham Norton Show, where one of the female guests sneaks in a couple of sly comments regarding Jason's body, and Jason ends up entertaining her flirting. Take a look. In November, why are you wearing a vest? <laughs> That's the first time I've ever wore a turtleneck. Okay. My, my mother's gonna be very proud of me. But I'm gonna be, it's gonna be close for peeling this off and getting the, getting the, I'm, the I'm fine with that, I'm fine with that, get naked. Je jaram na te ariani. And for the gentleman? Oh, yes. That's how that is. For the gentleman. <laughs> how tall are you? Uh, I think 6'5. Six, 6'5? Five. Six, five. Oh, yeah. Wow. He talks That's funny because my dad's like 5'9 and my, my mom's 5'8. So I don't know. Where did he you got lucky. <laughs> I've seen that happen before. It's so weird. Yeah, Quest yeah, questions know. were asked. <laughs> the next clip we have is one of Jason's other appearances on The Graham Norton Show, where they discuss the awkward situations Jason is put in when women take pictures with him. You are found quite Can a grab thing to do when particularly couples ask you for photographs. Explain what you do. 
Well, a married couple comes up and they want to take a picture, and then generally it's the woman that wants to get the hug, and then they want me to push their husband away. Uh, here you are. Uh, 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 this is. This is real. He's like doing some acting. Um, oh, oh, look at that. Oh, beautiful. Check that out. This is really pretty. And this last one is is kind of doubly cruel because uh, uh, obviously she she's killed a pet dog. And, uh, and you're holding her. And, uh, and you autograph over her face. Away. When you sign the photograph, you wrote, you sign over his face. <laughs> yeah. Daddy. Don't worry about the beer. Don't worry about the beer. Good. Okay. Let me just sign the photograph. Nice, funny. <laughs> the last clip we have is with Betty White on the Conan O'Brien. Betty White, where your she gets old ass. These old women love him. Jason Momoa's magazine cover. Take a look. In the cover of Men's Health in the UK, which uh, and it's a very look at that. Build arms like this. Whoa. Fantastic. <laughs> Are you okay, Betty? Uh, I'm getting better. <laughs> They love him. <laughs> they love him. I mean, he's a very attractive man. And, you know, he has a real nice build. He's real tall. He's 6'5". Like, that's very tall. Um, So, yeah, I, I understand. I understand why. Y'all let me know what y'all thought about the video, though. Let me know what other videos you want me to react to. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.